Mm. Why you wanted to add that song? Like brown skin girls. Because it talks about how pretty your brown skin is, and I want you guys to always know that you have pretty skin. You have pretty skin. Thank you, baby. <laughs> Kind words are the only ones we need to speak. Good vibes in the corner here, but Kevin Neek. Good vibes in the corner here, but Kevin Neek. Hey, what's up? It's your girl, Karen Neek. Welcome back to my channel, Karen Neek's Corner. Today, I kind of want to explain real quick why I said I wasn't going to be posting YouTube videos and then changed my mind. And it's just because I realized I was going through a negative situation and I was dwelling in it and... I thought I had to like give up everything or if I film it made me feel like I was being fake but I know that a negative situation or a negative experience doesn't define me doesn't mean that that's all that I am so I'm going to continue to do what makes me happy so that way I'm not always dwelling in that I am moving forward and making those changes so there is no need for me to not do what makes me happy and <laughs> I know that what I do brings other people happiness as well. Like last night when I was at work, which is technically Saturday night because I post on Monday, um, one of my co-workers was like, hey, I just was meaning to tell you thank you for that compliment that you gave me the other day. I've been thinking about it often and it really did make my day. And I was like, what? Like that was just a sign also that the good Lord be looking out for me because I was really in that spot where I thought I'm really a bad person because that's what those people were saying dealing with that situation and i could have reacted better but it doesn't make me a bad person so i decided there's a lot of good things that i do there's a lot more positive that i do than negative so i'm going to continue to do what keeps me positive and happy and that's making videos so today i'm going to take real wounds and teach y'all how to make a fake scar so avery wanted to do this video with me i was going to do a voiceover because i've done this before so Previously, I've done this for Jordan six years ago and I had like a better makeup palette. Um, now I just use what's laying around again. And this is all stuff that you'll find in your home and I'll show you guys. Um, I did one on Jordan's forehead and we tricked people with it and I did one on Avery's thigh and pretend like we burnt her and did a prank on Jordan. But I don't know, I wasn't really feeling the footage on that one so I haven't posted it. And those are the only two that I've ever done. So hey, Avery wants me to do it on her forehead to show it to you guys. So I'm going to do that and yeah, I'll actually post pictures here of what the scars look like, so trust me you guys, I think it's just in time for Halloween, it's like four days before Halloween, so hopefully it gets in, it even like gets viewed so that people can use it, but if not, you can use it for other things and you can use it in the future, so next Halloween guys. <laughs> so yeah, let's get into it! All right, guys. So we're doing like a double video. So I'm gonna be teaching. I'm gonna be teaching on my channel, Karen's Corner, how to do a scar from a scratch and things that you have at home. And they're gonna be also making scars and doing a prank on their aunties on their channel. Again. Yeah. Okay. So the things you guys will need is toilet paper, lotion, and whatever makeup palettes you can find at home. So what you do is just pull off a small piece of toilet paper. It probably doesn't even have to be this big. It's just, just gonna like be like a piece. <laughs> no. Then we're gonna put it right here. Hmm? And we're gonna get, so hold this right here, Avery. Then we're gonna get some lotion. Lotion. Yes. Gonna put it, yeah. move your hand. I'm going to Okay. <laughs> Girl. I thought you said <laughs> Okay, then you're just gonna um get it wet so that it'll stay. <gasps> so now that the toilet paper is soaked with lotion, it'll stay. And her hair is also Show the camera, Avery. It's soaked with lotion. We're going to create the scar. Mommy, mommy, I wish we yes. did we, I wish we did a scar. On my eye. Oh yeah, that would be cool, huh? <laughs> Avery is obsessed with um, Lion King, and we just bought Lion King Live, so we watch it on our TV. But she always sings the songs. She just says she wishes she had a scar on her eye because that's how much she loves that movie. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with like a darker tone first, and she is a brown skin girl. Don't mind my awesome singing skills, huh? Sing it, Avery. Oh. <laughs> Brown skin Wait, do you say girl, cow? skin just like 
background. So I'm just going in with this darker skin tone to make it look more like her flesh, the paper. Yeah. And then we're gonna put that. That's right? Yeah, we're gonna put other colors on it too, huh? What do it look like? Looks good. Ooh, did you see it? It don't look like my thumb. It looks like my. Hey, 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 don't touch. Oh, the white is the lotion. It's gonna dry up. You just wanna color the whole tissue like a flesh color almost. And then we're gonna take the edges and get a darker color. Mommy, mm -hmm. why you wanted to add that song? Like brown skin girls. Because it talks about how pretty your brown skin is, and I want you guys to always know that you have pretty skin. You have pretty skin. Thank you, baby. <laughs> Can I see what it looks like? Mm -hmm. Wait. So you want to like darken the er the edges to make it look more like a burn, like you know, burnt skin. Yeah. Like it's coming into burnt skin. Okay, so it's looking good, Avery. Now let's add some red. So I only have this palette that has like a red tone in it, but you can. I had a better palette when I did Jordan's. Oh, doesn't that look like a burn mark, guys? Okay, so that's how you make that. And you can add blood if you want, but this is just Bye. stuff that you have at home to make one. Whether you learn to heal a wound by not dwelling in a negative space and not letting a negative situation define you, or whether you learn to create a fake scar, I'm happy. Please forgive me for how like the setup is fitting in the screen. I am, this is a new area for me, if you cannot tell. It might not look perfect this time, but as I'm learning to work with this space, it'll be adjusted better next time. But I don't know, that's, that's all I have. <laughs> Thanks for always being in my corner.